but guess what? I'm going to be real. Not too many of the Greg Hills going to come for free and just give y'all this kind of knowledge or tell y'all this kind of story. That ain't going to happen. They're going to be like, how much? Oh, y'all ain't paying nothing? Oh, I ain't going there. Oh, when they come, they're going to give y'all a fluff message. They're going to tell y'all just keep going. No, no, no. Y'all can keep going. Y'all can work as hard as y'all want. But if you have no strategy, then it's not going to be nothing. How do you get strategy, Mr. Hill? How do you understand how to do it? You have to read. And if you don't read it, you can still watch on YouTube. You can um, listen to books. Like, there's other ways. But that's why I'm so critical about people. Make sure you're taking, make sure every eight to ten minutes, all right? That's why I'm so critical about when y'all young right now, how do you use your free time? Like, there should be no time specifically, because when I say, if y'all want to make money, all y'all raise your hand, right? So that means in y'all free time, it shouldn't be like, oh, I'm on Instagram, uh, I'm saying hit my phone, or Honesty Box, or all that other stuff. You should be in the lab, like, okay, hold up. Like I said, Bill Gates a billionaire, let me read his book, let me see what I need to do. How can I be hustling right now? What can I do in eighth grade to kind of get my, my mindset right, so in 10th grade, I got my own business, I got my own hustle. Or, I, I meet so many cats that want to design t-shirts, I'm like, dude, do y'all know that online right now, right? If I want to say, say, uh, what's your name? Huh? Zaid. So say if I want to have like Zaid Empire, I want to start a clothing line, Zaid Empire. Do y'all know there's websites that I can go through, put a logo up, and have that logo on shirts, have that logo on uh, iPhone cases, have that logo on tiles. I can have my own website for free, and it can be online today. <coughs> That can happen. That's, it doesn't, it's technology now, that's, that's what it is. But guess what? A lot of time, we don't, we don't, we're not looking for those opportunities. Like, I tell people all the time, they say they want to make money. I say, let me see your phone. And then I go through their they, they Google search. They ain't, talk, they, ain't, they ain't looking at no, okay, how do I, at, 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 at middle school, how do I start my business? At middle school, how do I make money? At middle school, how do I do this? Even, especially my athletes, right? It's, it's man, it's, uh, I hear these kids say they want to go to the league, right? And then I'm like, okay, okay, you want to go to the league when you practicing? Oh, my team practice at 8 o'clock. I said, no, 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 when, when you practice? He's like, what you mean? I practice with my team. I said, so you think Kyrie Irving, the LeBron James, the Kevin Durant, they just practice with their team? Do you think they was hooping when everybody else was hooping? <clears throat> nah. And do you think even, even when they did practice by themselves, do you think they were just hooping for two hours a people? Nah, they was working on the right for an hour. They were working on the left for an hour. They just working on, you think Kyrie can finish the way he finished just because he was hooping? No, that's, that's hour after hour finessing with the, jelly him with the right, jelly him with the left, day after day after day after day. So it kills me, I look at cats that say they want to do all this stuff, but then I look at their work ethic, right? And then this is, this is where it happens, this is where it happens. I look at the way they treat people. Because this is the game. There's so many people right now that have so much talent, they could, could be in the league, they could be in the NFL, but guess what, they don't respect nobody. They don't respect the people around them. They don't respect their peers. They be cursing out teachers. They be cursing out people. And guess what? People like that, they get cut. People like that, they don't make it. That's not even a sports. That's just in general in business and life. If you go around not respecting people, doing what you want to do, do you want to help? Like, say, say what? Say, ask me this, right? So say if I just slapped you right now, right? And then I went out the door, I came back, and I said, hey, bro, can you, you, can you help me with that camera? What you going to do? You're going to be like, nah, bro, right? But let's, let's be clear, right? A lot of y'all, some of y'all in school right now, some of y'all with y'all parents, that's exactly what y'all doing, right? The teacher tell you to but chill out. Teacher may be wrong. You're like, no, nah, I ain't chilling out. F you. I've seen, I, I taught this year. I've seen cats to my face. I'm like, hey, bro, put up your phone. We have a test out right now, right? Why are you on your phone? Nah, Mr. Hill, I ain't on that, bro. Not today. I said, I understand. Maybe in your household something's going on. Maybe, maybe you got abused last night. I don't know what's going on, but still, I'm here for you. Put up your phone, bro. Oh, okay, now nah, I don't that. So then what happens when in a year they need that recommendation? What happens? Like, what happens? Because I'm cool. I can relate, but some teachers, they, they can't relate. Some police officers, they can't relate. That's how people get killed. So that's why I'm telling y'all, to be real, it's, it's not even on talent. It's about respect. The people that do respect the other peers, those are the people they want to see succeed. So 